Hello my friends and welcome to this tutorial and guide for the Milano hole number 5 part 4 and this is also hole number 5 in the upcoming tournament on the Vegas Sound Sundown. We're going to play this one on the right side here and we are going to stay away from the left side as I do think it's the approach from the left side is going to be harder than by going on the right side. The drive is going to be harder here on the right side uh, so we will need to have that in mind. Three bars of topspin is gonna be enough. We're just going to adjust there. Let the ball do the job over there on the fairway. 6.7. And we do just make the ball do the job. Hit it great. Should be bouncing out there nicely anyway. So using the side spin as well. And now we just want to stay away from the bunker which we do even though it's close so we can just have that in mind that it's actually enough to give us just two bars of topspin with that type of wind. Headwind three bars then we can take one and a half to two bars of topspin when we do have slight tailwind. So important there to stay away from the bunker even though you will hit yourself into the bunker or shoot yourself into the bunker you will be able to reach for the green in two. And and again, the reason I'm going on the right side is that we will be having a more, I would say, flat option to go on the green towards the pin. Instead of going on the left side uh, to give us a very tough approach to the pin, uh, as it's very, very uh, weird there. Our opponent went to get a really really weird one there. I'm absolutely going to watch this replay but it went amazingly so he got that little glitch here actually to make it roll uh, through the whole rough there. So bounced it here and then bounced it over here up to the pin. So that is absolutely a way to go as well if you do have the accurate uh, Accuracy for that one. So we're going to go in max side spin to the right to combine with two bars of side uh, backspin. So we're going to play a little bit downhill. We're going to come in here. We're going to be very very close with that shot, and still a decent shot, and we have a great way for the eagle there, and it's very awesome to see our opponent to take that route down the middle and actually got it to work and should be shipping this one in kind of easily especially when it is headwind and that just means that if you do have tailwind uh, i would say i would say tailwind in general then you can go for that bounce the risk you take there if, if you miss that you will be into the bunker or into the rough and then you will have a tough time to get it up to the green you can go along and make it fall back down and uh, or you can in that case go on the right side or you can actually play on the left side as well so my friends thanks a lot for watching this tutorial on hole number five i say thank you to my opponent that showed the other other way to go and actually how that risk and reward uh, method by going on the middle way uh, actually could be here from the second tee. It's uh, hole number five of the Milano played from the second tee which is pro and expert division. If you do have any questions please pick up in the comment section below and I will be happy to help you out. And in the end I will wish you the best of luck in the Vegas Sundown tournament.